another week gone. Start of a new week. Um, yeah. yeah, basically last week was a funny week. It was a short week for me to be honest because um, I didn't do a full week. Um, I had a few days off. Um, well, it was my birthday. Um, so I have been really since the start of the year doing six days a week. So it was nice to have a bit of a break. So there wasn't a full week done. But um, what we'll do is we'll have a look at um, what we got up to. Um, wasn't really an awful lot to be honest. Uh, it was more getting vans prepped, ready, um, ready to put on sale. Um, so don't forget if you're enjoying the vlog, um, please subscribe to us. If you're enjoying it as well, don't forget to hit the like. Um, and let's have a look um, at what we got up to. So yet again, I'm back in the compound washing another van and that's all I've seemed to do this week is just wash vans off and getting them ready for sale but the sun's out the birds are singing I don't know if you can hear the birds well I can anyway and I'm washing off now let's have a look it's an auto trail tracker RB so we'll give this a wash off. Um, I'm going to wash all the sides off firm today. That's all I'll probably have time for. And then I'll come in tomorrow and I'll do the roof. Um, but let's get this washed off now. And what a day today. This van that I've just done, I'll give it a wash round. It is a bit grubby. It's, it's not grubby, it's just that there's a lot of little bits of green and all the little bits of nooks and crannies. So I'll give that a wash round. I'm shattered now, so uh, tomorrow, first thing, I'm gonna go and do all the roof and then go back around it and get in all the little nooks and crannies. Uh, so it's just gonna take a bit of while to wash this off. Um, also, what I have done, let me show you, was the Bailey. Here's the Bailey. Um, we recorded that and did all the photographs for that ready to go on the internet as well. So that's something else we did. But yeah, the auto trail starting to look um, quite nice now. But say tomorrow morning I'll get on the roof and then um, go back around it and get it looking nice. And then I'll show you inside and you can have a look at the layout of this auto trail tracker RB. It's not easy cleaning these motor rooms off, you know takes a lot of hard work. Remember the other week um, when um, we had the problem with the cracked windscreen on the Adria? Right, I'll just show you inside actually. Uh, let's have a look. Uh, so uh, we're inside the Adria. So uh, there is the little chip. Now this is going to pass an MOT um, because it's not in the line of sight of the driver. But the thing is like we said before, when you're spending this type of money for a motor home, um, it looks like, let's say, we're going we're gonna to have to put a new windscreen in. So we've ordered that. Remember now, so what we also did is we got the windscreen fitted. dinner time um, so got my buddies but what I normally do between one and two is I take my meetings so if you can just see here we have John give us a wave John and what we're doing there is we're just planning for the motorhome and caravan show that goes out on the Sunday of every month so we'll have a buddies have a dinner and then just plan it say bye bye John So the weather's actually got a little bit better now, it's stopped raining. Um, 
it looks all right actually the weather does just have a look we've got a few blue skies no dirty clouds now so i'm going to crack on and get the roof done on the sorter trail right i am pretty keen to get onto this motorhome roof the sorter trail um, and i'll show you the reason being is look this is going to take me a while to get this clean so uh, it's going to take a bit of scrubbing to get this one done so this is why I'm keen to get on and get this done so now I've got a bit of break in the weather I want to try and get some of it done before the weekend's out and would you believe it I've just got everything ready to start cleaning off and it's started to rain but we've got sunshine so I think the gods are against me today to be honest with you um, yeah, I'm going to regroup and try again later on. As you can see now, if you can see the rain now, it's starting to rain again. Let's go have a look and see how John's getting on. So, step on now, John. Yeah. All bolted in. Yeah. Plugged in. Huh? Plugged in. Not yet. Right. Not yet. Well, give us a shout when we do the big test, eh? Yeah. All right. So I'll leave them alone. Um, why don't we have a look at a van that we've had in this week? Um, it's an Aldi Signature, I think. Let's go and have a look at it, eh? see what we've got. Yeah, here it is. It's a 2019, here we go, Aldi Signature. Let's have a look. There we go. That's the van. It's a 155. Let's have a look inside, see what we've got. So Aldi Signature 155. Get the right key. Let's have a look. So dinette. Microwave. We've got the kitchen area, fixed bed, and then combined toilet washroom. Yeah, this is going to want to go clean. This is so obviously what miles it's done. Let's have a look. <coughs> And that's done, I don't know if you can see, 3,359 miles, so less than 5,000. You know, skylight over the cab, another one in the dinette area. It's got a tally, let's have a look underneath. That's good news, we've got the carpets, there's your consumer. There's your pump. And we've got a tally there. And then a little big size wardrobe. Yep. TV aerial. Freestanding table. So there we go. Aldi Signature 155. What we also did as well, um, so we've been quite productive today. We had one of our vans come back because the um, reversing camera wasn't working so we've got a new camera now I'll just show you there we go we've got one camera reversing now and that's the old one so we put a new one in for them so they can see behind. So I've got something else done as well. So there we go. 
And guess what? The sun's come out again and it's stopped raining. So I'm going to come out while it's nice, get on that roof and see if I can uh, get this roof done on the Salter Trail. As you can see, I've got about half of it done. Still plenty more work to do over the other side. So I'll go have my dinner, a few other things to do, then I'll come back and see if I can get most of it done. I don't know if I'm going to get it all done today, but we'll have a good go. So there you go, I'm pretty pleased how well this roof's come up. Um, it was it was mucky, so I just took a bit of doing that. As, um, so that's taken me all afternoon to do. Not that you'd know on time lapse. Um, so when sometimes people say, oh, is that all you've done all afternoon? You've now seen with some roofs, there is a lot of hard work involved in cleaning them off. Now I think we're gonna have a cup of tea. Right, so I finally finished the auto trail off, um, give it a wash round. I haven't watched, I haven't shown, filmed it basically, just washing around it because you've already seen the roof and all the other bits that I've done to it, so I didn't want to bore you too much. So, there we go. This is the auto trail tracker RB. Let's go have a look inside. So what you've got, um, it's it's a four berth, I think it's only got two belted seats, so we've got the kitchen area and then at the back we have the bed, which you can walk all the way around. And then let's have a look in the washroom, we have cassette toilet, wash basin and a separate, yeah I'll just show you that. Quite a nice shower that is, separate shower with a wardrobe and then a hubs grill oven. There we go, there's the bed. And then we've got the um, two bench seats which will make up into a double. Let's have a look see what the mileage of it is. It's 20,798, so it's 21,000 miles. So, I shall get that across the other side. And we've got plenty of storage as well, all the way around. Give it a quick hoover out, do a stat sheet on it, do the video, and we'll get this up for sale. Right, so now I've done the auto trail, um, I've washed it all off and everything, which I'm really pleased with. Um, I've got to do a stat sheet now on it before I can get this on the internet. So I'm just filling out my stat sheet. So if anybody asks um, anything about the van, I've got all the inf information there to hand. And then when I've done that, what we're going to do then is I'm going to video it up and photograph it. And then that's ready to then to go on the internet for sale. Um, we have had a problem with the battery. So we've just put a new battery on. There we go. So we've put a new vehicle battery on that. So we'll put that back together. So we know it's going to be starting all the time. And there's your orchard trail. So there you go, a bit of a short week. Um, it's all about just prepping the vans, getting them ready for sale. Um, we, we had obviously already checked these vans off. So when we started the vlog, we were halfway through the process. So over the next few weeks, you will start to see 
the full process of what we have to do where we're showing you the checking off all the different motorhomes and the camper vans um, don't forget um, if you are interested in coming have a look at the vans it is appointment only at caravansincampers.co.uk if you are looking at um, selling a motorhome webuycampers.co.uk just fill out the form we'll get in contact with you um, we come to you and uh, transfer the money straight into your account you can get me on any of the Twitter account. Twitter account is SY45RP. Also on Instagram, the Motorhome Man. If you've enjoyed it, please subscribe to, to the channel and also hit the like button. So I think we're pretty much done for this week. Um, and we'll see you in the next one.